love to work with Bruno Mars because he's just, I think, the best performer out right now. No one's putting on a show like him. I really, I really challenge myself as a singer and talking about things that I, that are on my mind. Love is my favorite subject, so everything from romantic love to self-love to lack of love to, you know, talking about my parents and there's just no, no subject that I shy away from really. All Right by Kendrick Lamar. That One Direction song, Drag Me Down, I don't feel guilty about it. I, I love it. It's a good record. <laughs> oh man, if I could fly, if like if you didn't have to be on long flights, that'd be awesome. Or maybe not fly, just coop, just teleportation. <laughs> I miss my Boston accent. I, I think I lost it though when I moved to California when I was 11. I lived there for about a year and then got signed within that year. So you can actually hear my accent still when I'm singing. Um, in Say Love, in the first verse, you can even hear it. It's like, this is us at our best and at our worst. At our best and at our worst. <laughs> so it's like, I wouldn't say that normally. Wouldn't say that normally, but you can hear, you can hear little tinges of it. It's just not as strong. The most rewarding part has been the incredible reception that it's gotten. Because you never know when you when you release music, especially after so long. So to see that people, you know, care and that they're digging it, that just means everything to me. That's that's been really cool. The most challenging part has just been um, living in the moment, not thinking too much about the future, but really celebrating every every small victory. Okay, I'm kind of. I do feel a little guilty about watching like The Real Housewives. So, and I, I don't I don't have cable at home. I just like watch things on my computer. But when I'm in hotel rooms, if there's a marathon on Bravo, you know, I'm, I'm glued to it. I've been dying to share it with them too. So it, it's like so gratifying and pretty surreal that I'm in the next chapter, the next phase of my life, and it's just beginning. And, um, that's why I wanted to release more than one song right off the bat because they've been so patient and understanding and they've, you know, they were spreading awareness with the Free JoJo campaign and really sticking by me and they got me through uh, to this next chapter. So I just wanted to show how appreciative I am and that I take nothing for granted.